Hello everyone, welcome back to Sydney and Starlet, and if you are new here, welcome. Welcome, enjoy the videos. videos. So today me and Sydney are going to be reading Baby Einstein, my first book of shapes. 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 So let's begin. What's this? A yolk. Circle. Circles can be so much fun, big and round, just like the sun. Some you can wear, some you can eat, and some you can bang when you march in the street. Fun with circles. Can you name all of the circles that you see? Cindy, what's this? What does that say? This is a drum. Was. Drum. Walk. This is a soccer ball. Say ball. Soccer ball. What's this? What is it? Can you read it? Read it. What is it? Pancakes. 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 What's this? Sauce. Sun. Say it. Don't add. Don't say sauce. It's sun. Sauce. Well, you got to add the letter N. Sun. Say it. Sun. Say. There you. There you go. Sort of. And then we got a soup bowl, and sunglasses. Can you say sunglasses? What use? What use? <laughs> All right, points to the circle shape that you can eat. Ooh, you can eat pancakes. Find the circle that makes these noises. Find the circles that make these noises. Slurp, rat, tat, tat. Uh, you can make the slurp sound with soup and then rat, tat, tat. I'm pretty sure it would be the drum when you bang the drum. Which circles can be found outdoors? Ooh, the sun. You can find the sun outside, definitely. And a soccer ball you could play with outside. And then sunglasses, you would wear those outside too because you got to protect your eyes from the sun. So, yeah. <laughs> Mainly the sun, though. That's the main thing you would find outdoors. Round is a word used to describe things that are shaped like circles. How many round ornaments do you see in this painting? One. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, fake. Eleven. Which, which ornament is your favorite? What colors are on it? Sydney, which ornament do you like? What's your favorite? God. Did you pick the star? Uh, well, that's not an ornament. I like the star too, but that's not the ornament. This has a star though. This has a star inside the circle ornament. This one is yellow and orange. It also has triangles on it to make up the shape of a star. Uh, can you find the ornament with colorful squares on it? This one has lots of squares. I can see blue, pink, orange, green, yellow. <laughs> and then how many stars do you see in this painting? There is one star. And then we have two stars. Gods. Yeah, I think, yeah, just two stars. What's this? Wag. Square. Draw four straight sides with great care and you will have a perfect square. Bath time always brings great smiles when splashing in a tub of big square tiles. Fun with squares. Point to the square item you can eat. Waffles. Can you say waffles? Waffles. Waffles, that's a square. I, I actually, that's kind of weird. I think a couple nights ago, I literally had a dream of waffles. I wasn't even craving waffles. I just had a dream of waffles for some reason. Can you think of other square shaped foods? Um, as of right now, the second, I can't think of any. I'm sure I could. Oh yeah, well there's, <laughs> there's uh, Cheez-It crackers that are squares. Sydney, Sydney, that's one of Sydney's favorite snacks is cheese it crackers, and those are in a in a square shape. Anyway, um, what kind of square is Baby New Newton Newton? However you say that, thinking about uh, a radio. Can you say radio? Radio. Radio. What is the boy doing? Do you have square tiles in your bathroom? How many square shapes can you find in your bathroom? Oh my goodness, we would find a lot of square shapes. Um, but he's splashing, he's splashing in the bath. Do 
you have any square tiles in your back room? Yeah, we do. Uh, what's this? Book! Books! Good job. And this is a checkered flag with squares on it. The flag itself is a rectangle, but inside the flag is a bunch of little squares. And so you would call it a checkered flag. We got throw pillows and bath tiles and waffles. This is another square page, a whole page dedicated to squares. Uh, fun with squares. What do all of these squares have in common? Do you have any square shaped toys or games in your room? Uh, the thing that all these have in common is that they are all toys. This is a toy train car. Well, there's train cars. And then this is a toy chest. The jack in the box, which is a square. Blocks, these are squares. Can you say any blocks? Yes. Blocks. Um, do you have any square shaped toys or games in your room? Yes, we do. We're not in my room right now though. Um, what color is the toy chest? What kind of toys do you think are inside? <laughs> so, what do you think would be inside here? Go, go, is that it? It's a toy chest, so that would mean it would have toys in there, but what kind of toys do you think would be inside the chest? Maybe like a doll or something? I don't know. Can you name all the letters on the blocks? B? B. What is this? A. S. C. E. U? U. And A. Or Q. No, that's, yeah, that's U and A. Oh no, that, this is a G. This is a G. If you flip it over sideways, you can see that it's a G in a weird font. What is the girl wearing the red shirt doing? What number is on the square she's hopping on? Um, what number is on the square she's hopping on? Uh, one, two, three, four. So I'm guessing this would be four. This would be four. And then five, six, seven. So this would be four. This is an oval. Can you say oval? Oval. Oval. An oval is a funny sight, but it can bring you great delight. Can you guess which oval may fly away soon? Could it be the beetle or perhaps a balloon? Huh. Can you say beetle? Bayog. Beetle. Can you say balloons? Yours. Balloons. Fun with ovals. Can you find any red ovals? Can you find a red oval? Can you find a red oval? Uh, wait, yo. This is red. This is red in an oval. This is this is also red. Can you say red? Wait. Red oval. It's a watermelon. This is also a red oval because it's a balloon. Look at the oval picture frame. What do you see in the frame? I see a little toddler holding a bear, a bear stuffed animal. Do you see any ovals? that live outside? Well, I see an egg's nest, a, a bird's nest that has eggs in it, which would be outside. Can you say eggs? Eggs. Eggs. I see a beetle, which would also be outside. Do you uh, point to the oval fruit? Can you think of any other oval foods? Can you find the watermelon? Where's the watermelon? What? Where's the watermelon? Where's the watermelon? Why, yeah, yeah. Watermelon, good job, it's right there. I think grapes are also ovals as well. Sydney, can you find the spoon? Balls. Where's the spoon? Book. Spoon, where's, where's the spoon? Book. There it is, there's the spoon. Oval, eggs are shaped like ovals. Have you ever decorated eggs? Yes, we have decorated eggs. Have you ever eaten a hard boiled egg? Yes, I have. Do you prefer fried or scrambled eggs? I prefer scrambled. How many eggs do you see? How many eggs? How many eggs are right here? One, two, three, four, five. No, there's like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven eggs. Oh, well, this is also an egg, so that might be eight. <laughs> All right. 
Uh, how many eggs have flowers painted on them? Uh, two eggs have flowers on them. Can you find the egg with no with two lambs on it? This is the this is this egg that has the lambs on it. What color is the egg with the ribbon attached to it? Sydney, what color is this? Pink. Green. Good job. Two eggs don't have any pictures or words painted on them. What color are they? What color are these? What color is this? Yo yo. What color is this? Pink. Pink. Good job. Rectangle. Rectangles have four sides. Can you find them all? Two sides are short and two sides are tall. Some get me clean at the end of the day and some help me out when I lose my way. Okay. Um, let's find all the rectangles together. Where's the microwave? Wait, wait. It's right there. Yeah, this is a rectangle. The bricks are also rectangle. This camera is rectangle. The stamp is also rectangle. Street signs. These are all long rectangles. What's this? What's that? Soap. Soak. Soap. You gotta add the P at the end. Soap. Soap. Joke. Soap. 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 There you go. Fun with rectangles. Can you name all of the colors on the stamp? Uh, I see red, white, and blue. Can you say blue? Yoke. Blue. I also see black. Uh, let's see. What else? A stamp is usually placed on something else that's rectangle. Do you know what that is? The stamp is us usually placed on an envelope to send letters or just mail. What numbers do you see on the stamp? Can you find the four on the street sign? Uh, what numbers do you see on the stamp? Um, 2001, 2000, 1999. <laughs> I see 98. And then where's the number four on the street sign? I see the number four. Do you see the number four? Where's the number four? Where's the number four? Four. The four is right there. Two. If, if you take away the two, you just see the four. Can you say four? Four. Four. Do you have any bricks on the inside or outside of your home? What about in your neighborhood? Yes, we do. And our neighborhood has some bricks in there, outside their houses too. <laughs> Can you find these other shapes on rectangles? Star and a circle. I see stars right there. Can you say stars? Cause. Stars. Where's the circle? The yolk. Where's the circle? Where's the circle? The yolk. There's a circle right there. And there's a circle right there. And there's an oval inside the circle. There's also a circle right there. And then there, there's circle bubbles over here. Rectangle. Fun with rectangles. Can you name all of these rectangles? How many of these rectangles can you find in your house? Sydney, what's this? Window. Wait, go. Window. What's this? It's a crib. What? what? Crib. What? What's this? Light switch. What? what? What's this? What? What's this? Bed. 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 And this is a rectangular frame. We have all of these at our house except for the crib. How many light switches are in your living room? Light switches flick up and down. With the light switch, you can turn lights on and off. Uh, I think we have two light switches in our living room. Oh wait, no, we have, I'm looking around. We are in our living room right now. I see three light switches. Uh, I lose track of where we are. Do you have any picture frames in your house? What kinds of pictures are in your frames? Yes, we have pictures in our house. We have pictures of family, 
and that's about it. That's all I can think of right now. Um, do you sleep in a crib or in a bed? What shape is your pillow? We sleep in beds and our pillow shapes are rectangle. Triangle. Triangles have three sides. Can you believe that? They can be trees, crayons, or pool ball racks. A triangle shaped jungle gym. Now that's a place to be. Can you name all the other triangles that you see? What's this? Great way. Pine tree. What is this? It's a pumpkin. Pumpkin, pumpkin get, eyes get, and get, nose. Get, get. The eyes and nose on the pumpkin are triangle. This is a sailboat and it has a triangle shape, pool ball rack, uh, bowling pins that made up the shape of a triangle, flags, and then the jungle gym, and crayons right there. Can you say crayons? Crayons. Crayons. Fun with triangles. How many triangles are on the pumpkin? Do you think the pumpkin has a scary face or happy face? Make a face like this pumpkin. This pumpkin looks happy to me, and I see three triangles on them. Point to the triangles that you can usually find outdoors. Uh, the sailboat is outdoors. And can you find the tree? Where's wait. the tree? Wait, wait. The pine tree, yeah, that's outside too. Um, how many trees can you spy out your window? Oh, see how many trees you can spy out your window the next time you travel in the car. How many crayons can you see? What do you like to draw with crayons? How many crayons are there? One? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten? Good. Nine. Eleven? Yeah, perfect. Walk. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. There's twelve crayons. What do you like to draw with crayons? You can draw smiley faces. You can even draw trees, too. You can draw a whole bunch of stuff with crayons. Triangle. Fun with triangles. Can you name all of the food items that you see? Well, this is ice cream. Can you say ice cream? Uh, wait. It's an ice cream cone. A peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Tortilla chips. Cheese. Candy corn. Do you think... Can you think of other triangle-shaped food? Uh, well, you could... Triangle-shaped food. Well, I mean, if you cut a slice of cake, that would be a triangle, so I guess that counts. Look in your kitchen to see what you can find. Points to the triangles that crunch when you bite into them. Which triangles would you eat for dessert? Well, this makes a crunch sound, the chip. And for dessert, like I said, a slice of cake. I haven't had cake in so long. <laughs> do you do you have a favorite kind of sandwich? Do you like your sandwiches to be cut into triangles or into rectangles? I don't have a favorite sandwich, but I usually eat them in rectangles. This is a heart. Wait, hold on. Before we continue, I want to see. Can you find the ice cream? Where's oh, wait, wait. Good job. Where's the cheese? Cheese. Where's the cheese? See. That's not cheese. See Where's cheese? cheese? This is cheese. 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 This is a tent. Good. Tent. What's this? Heart. Hearts. The heart is a very the heart is a very favorite shape of mine. For it reminds me of love and Sandy and Valentine's. <gasps> Sydney, can you find the heart shaped leaf? Where's the leaf? Yay. Good job. It's in the shape of an upside down heart. Fun with hearts. What color hearts do you see? Well, this is a red heart. Can you say red? Wait. And this is green. Wait. Not green. Uh, this is a heart candy box. This is a plain card. Can you say card? Go. Card. Bleeding heart flowers. I didn't know that was a type of flower. I had no idea that even existed. What's this? Girls, star. Stars are up in the sky. So pretty to see, but they're also on pinwheels and under the sea. Can you find, find the stars that are found in nature? Find the stars you can use to play dress up. Well, you can find, uh, well, you can find the sea star 
in nature and the night sky has stars which is also nature i guess so there's that um to play dress up with uh, find the stars you can use to play dress up you can use these glasses to play dress up can you say glasses yeah yes they're like sunglasses uh what's this it's a pinwheel 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 what color is this where what color is this yo yo good job what's that yo yo oh yes this is the color yellow but what is it it's a sea star hey god sea star there are stars you can find underwater all right last page what's this diamond Great. diamond at the park there are so many diamonds to spy on cards on playing fields and on kites in the sky can you say kite got kite this is a diamond shaped kite there's a baseball diamond diamond playing cards fun with diamonds can you name all of these diamond shapes baseball diamond kites and the playing cards that have the diamond on them crescents can you you're you're sure to find crescents on a summer night people relaxing under the moonlight Ooh, fun with crescents which one of these crescent shapes uh is not like the others what do the other three have in common? Okay, so what's this? Hey, no. That's a banana. What's this? It's a croissant. Wait, sauce. Croissants. This is a watermelon. You can eat watermelon. Can you say watermelon? Well, he is. Watermelon. All three of these you can eat. But this is the moon. Moon. You can't eat the moon. So this would make this one different than all the rest. And that was the last page. So, that is it for today, everyone. I really hope you all enjoyed it, and we'll see you all next time. Bye-bye, everybody. Bye-bye. Pick out your favorite page. Can you say waffles? Waffles. Can you say frame? Wait. Cheese. Cheese. Star. God. Moon. Moon. That's the moon. That's a very good page. Square. What? What's your favorite thing here? Bag. The bath. Good choice. All right. Bye-bye!